Long before Boeing, Microsoft, Starbucks, or Amazon, Washington was known for its world-class agriculture. Apple orchards and waving wheat fields, hops for the finest beers, and potatoes perfect for your favorite french fries. Most of the world now sees our state very differently. The home of high-tech, high-flying jets and highly caffeinated beverages. Yet agriculture is still very much at the heart of what makes Washington what it is. Our soil, weather, and irrigation allows farmers and orchardists to grow many types of crops, from blueberries, onions, and tulips, to asparagus, oysters, and wine grapes. The diversity makes Washington one of our nation's most important farming states. But what is the health of the Washington farm and farmer? Finding that answer would be the point of one of the longest and most ambitious rural reporting projects the Spokesman Review has ever undertaken. A year in the fields, the state of the Washington farmer began publishing in the pages of our newspaper and on our website in the spring of 2017 and ran for 15 consecutive months. Eight reporters were deployed across the state to find and write the stories of the people behind the fields of grain, fruit, and vegetables. The Spokesman Review's five photographers shot thousands of pictures. Upward of 200 were published in our print edition and even more online. Together, our reporters and photographers logged more than 7,000 miles on state highways and country roads and spoke with more than 300 farmers and agriculture experts across Washington. The amount of time across our newsroom for each of the different story packages in the series easily surpassed hundreds of hours. The Spokesman Review has long given voice to the Washington farmer. Editions of our newspaper in the early 1900s even carried the tagline, The Farmer's Family Newspaper. Over the last two years, as we began telling these stories, we learned so much. We found fear and uncertainty. We also found families with hope, courage, heart, and pride. This is their story. This is Washington's story. This is A Year in the Fields.